Okay, so in this quick tutorial, what we're going to do is we're going to target this submit button here at the bottom of this form. And in the previous tutorial, I styled this form. So this is a form embedded using Gravity Forms, which is a great plugin if you want to put forms on your WordPress website. But the default formatting of this form is completely different to this. So I styled it all like this in a previous tutorial. But this time we're going to look at this submit button and the colouring and styling of the submit button is the default that comes with Gravity Forms and also linked into the current theme I'm using which is a Parallax Pro theme by Studio Press. And you see at the moment it's black with white writing and then when I hover over it it turns pink with white writing still. And that formatting is because this current theme I'm using it is basically black and if go to the bottom it's got pink elements with it so this is the default styling that has been taken up by gravity forms what we're going to do is going to change this so I want it so when you're looking at it normally I want the button to be pink and I want the writing to be white still but I want to make the text bolder and then when I hover over it I want it to change a light pink color with a dark gray text so that's what we need to do now and we can do that with some simple CSS styling. So I'll go into my dashboard. I'll just right click and open in a new window to keep this front page still open. Okay, so first thing we need to know, we need to know what form this is. So I'll have a look at my forms. And I have many forms here, but the consultancy, which this one is, it's form ID seven. Okay, so that's what we need to do. So now we go into appearance an editor to open up the CSS style sheet for this theme and we need to find the styling for form 7 so I'm just going to do control F and I'm going to look for underscore 7 because I know styling code has that on it and here we go this is all the styling for the different elements of this form and we did all this in a previous tutorial which there is a link for but what we want is this code here specifically because this is the code for the submit button. And this is what we've done so far. So we've said we want it to float left, height 60 pixels, width 93%, a minimum width of 270, clear both, and also a border of 2 pixels solid and this color here, which is the blue color. So we just need to add to this to change it. So there's nothing in here that tells us what the color of the button is and also the color of the hover button because that's already styled somewhere else for standard buttons with this theme. But we can go and write some code in here and overwrite this. So first off, we want background. It specifies the color of the background. And we want this to be a pink color. And I know that this pink color is this code so I'm just going to copy in. Okay, so that in theory should change the background color from black to pink of this button. I'll refresh the home page and it has, which is great. But now when I hover over it, nothing happens. So we need to set a hover background color now to be a lighter pink color. And you'll also see here there's nothing, there's no code here for a hover. So I'm just going to copy this code for the button paste it in but here we've got input I'm gonna put this right in here colon hover and this targets the hover styling for the button so currently it's all exactly the same so we just want to change background color so I've copied the new color and I'm going to paste it there and this is a lighter pinky color so I'm going to save that so now when I refresh and I hover over you see it turns this very light pink color and actually I'm going to do something else when I hover over it I want this blue border to change to the original pink color. So I'm going to put that in now. And that is this border. So this is the color of the normal button. 
we want the border to change to that color when you hover over it so I'll save that there we go so it's coming along so I said I wanted this to get in touch to still be white but I wanted it to be a bolder thicker white so this is the styling for the non hover button so we just need to do a font weight and now we can either write bold in here or we can write the number 900 in here which represents a thicker darker font so I'm going to use 900 bold will do the same effect so I'll update that refresh this page see that text has got bolder now So when we hover over it, we want the text to go from white to a darker gray color. So we'll add that now. So we've got the color. So again, there's actually, there's no indication here of the color of the font. Cause again, that's styled somewhere else. We're in the theme styling, general theme styling. So we'll add that in now. So it's just color, which is targets the color of the font. And we want it to be a, a gray color, which is this code is a gray color. Save that, and then we'll refresh the page. And there we go. Okay, so there you have it. Just some simple, quick, but effective styling of gravity forms to change the submit button color and font. As always, make sure you head over to my website, which is www.neilcurtis.me to get more WordPress and general website tutorials and also subscribe to my YouTube channel so you hear about any new videos as soon as they happen.